Hello everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today, Maniacs, we are being spoiled to death by these young ladies here. They are giving us yet another new song to really kind of get us prepared for this new album coming. Um, they've done it with a new band, well not like, I guess a new band, a new band to me at least, um, called The Warning. And they've given us a new song called Show Them. And um, I've never heard The Warning before, but I believe they're another also um, all-girl band, if I remember seeing correctly from some of the teasers for this music video. So um, I'm excited to dive into them and see what they're all about and how well they blend with our ladies here from Bandmaid. So without further ado, guys, let's not waste more time. Here we go. <laughs> Okay, well, the lead singer for The Warning can belt. Uh, uh, let's start that over, please. I was not ready for that. Let me actually start here. Uh, oh, I did not mean to do that. No, I, why? No. Give me back my volume, please. I did not mean to do that. I think I broke it. I think it still works. We're going to find out. I'm pressing all kinds of buttons. I'm falling apart. Holy shit, I'm so sorry. Okay. I just, I just, all I want to do is start over the song. I just, I just want to start over. I wasn't ready. I wasn't prepared, okay? Alright, let's try this again. The fuck? Oh, all oh, they have the, they have all the bands there. Or all band members, I mean. That's sick. She's a little sassy. Nice. Ooh. It's like a singing battle. I love it. Oh. That makes sense now. Okay. I I see now. It's like the whole because I remember all the teasers were like them like doing like uh like stand downs like guitar versus guitar, drummer versus drummer, singer versus singer, and they're doing it in the music video also. Okay, so that's what all that meant. That's funny. I love this, like, almost like a competition, like, I'm the better singer. No, I'm the better singer. No, I'm the better drummer. I'm the better drummer. That's so funny. Oh, my gosh. Okay. That's awesome. I was not, I, I was not, that was, okay. I can't talk. Let's just keep going. Ooh, Miku. Let's go. Are you kidding me? What? Well, that was sick. Okay. I gotta say, oh, a little drumming coming. I'm sorry, I did not mean to interrupt the drum solo, our little drum moment there. But I love seeing, like, honestly, how well they all play so, like, smoothly together. Like, I feel like when you would have like that many instrument hit um, instruments going on and that much like happening all at the same time, it would almost get lost. I feel like, or like some would get lost. Some of those, we got. I will say, Psyche's voice is sticking out way stronger than um, the Warnings lead singer. Um, and I've never, I don't think I've ever heard like her, like have such powerful and very like clean highs like that. Like not saying obviously Psyche like, can't sing clean, but like in this moment, like her highs are so, so like just perfection, honestly, you know? And I'm like, I love like how it's like, they're keeping it where it's like, everybody's kind of shining all in their own individuality, you know? It's like their drummer shining there and BMA's drummer shining, you know? Um... You know, Misa's shining, their bassist is shining. You know, Konami's shining, their guitarist is shining. You know, and even Miku's still getting a chance to even sing. Like, she even gave us some un insanely good, like, backing vocals there. So it's like, I love that everybody's getting ability to contribute to this song. 
And honestly, they sound really good together for two bands basically making an entire song with all their people, all their members are there. That's so freaking cool. I mean, honestly, what a fun song, too. Like, this is sick. I'm done with pain. that try to change me. Oh, her English has gotten so good. Oh, I see what they're doing. I see. So they're giving Psyche the higher range, um, vocal range, where they're letting the uh, lead vocalist for the warning kind of hit that little lower range so you can hear like the... And then, like, down below, you hear this. Da, 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 da. So it's like, it makes it even sound more full that way, honestly, in terms of the vocals, which is really freaking cool. So if you listen closely, like, I, at first I couldn't hear it, but now I can really hear the difference in terms of Psyche's voice versus her voice um, from the warning. So, like, listen closely here. You can always shine brighter. So it's like, shine brighter. Versus shine brighter. I, I don't. I, I can't get. I don't know what her vocal range is. Um, I can hit Psyche's better, which is it's funny because I'm a male. But <laughs> we're not gonna go there. But <laughs> uh, my high my high range is my best range. I'm just gonna say it right now. I don't know why it is. It just is. I have a very weird and um, innate ability to do higher like voices and like singing ability. I don't know. I don't know where I get it from. Who knows? But anyways. When you take a Yeah, it's really interesting. It's like Psyche's vibrato is like right in the high range, and like the uh, lead singer for the warnings, like um, vibrato is in like her mid range, which is so interesting because we, we can see like what the way they start the song off. That obviously their lead singer can do it too in terms of like just high belts like that. So it's cool that she kind of like almost like lets Psyche maybe be like more in her comfortable range, um, and then she takes more of like maybe like her mid range and maybe she's good at, but maybe not her favorite, but. You know, it's all about, obviously, when you're doing a collaboration, it's about, you know, sacrificing one thing for the other person to sound good or to just make the best possible song, you know? So I love that. Hell yeah. Great collaboration. Oh, go off, Misa. Oh, wow. Lead singer on the guitar. Let's go. Ha, <laughs> I love that little mini like battle. <laughs> oh, that's Amiku for a minute. Hell yeah. Woo! Woo! They're now doing it together. Wow! Even their eyes sound together good. They're good together. Ending with the little bass at the end there? That was sick. That was cool. I've never seen a band end on a bass like that before. That was dope. Wow, okay, guys, that was awesome. I didn't know what to think of this because I was like, I was seeing all the teasers and it looked like they were both playing together. Um, and I didn't know if that was like supposed to be like a, bit, like a little fun little thing they were doing to like. Um, promote the song like they were like, like gonna be like oh let's pretend to like do like a little like battle of like guitarist versus guitarist singer versus singer drummer versus drummer as like a promo and whatnot because obviously it would draw attention i mean it caught my attention um but they actually really kind of did that in the music video which is kind of like it kind of i guess represents like the song in a way of, like show them like let's show them what we got like on both sides and like almost empowering female lead um really all female you know bands basically where like every single member is you know, female um, singers, you know, guitarists, female drummer, everything, you know? So it's almost like a almost like a very empowering song for, like, female-led and fe full female bands, you know, uh, in a way. So it's like, show them what you got, show them what we can do, you know? 
but I love the little almost like competitiveness they added to it, just a little bit. Like, um, it, it's obviously clearly like all for collaboration. It's nothing, obviously, no competition whatsoever. But I, I love the idea there because it, it, it's like you don't really see anything like that. You know, I don't think I've ever seen a band, two bands basically playing together with all of their members. Like, I figured it'd be like, you know, if they were going to do something like this, I figured it'd be like, oh, it's bandmate featuring their, like, you know, lead singer or something like that. You know, but no, it was the whole entire, mem- all the members, I should say, of every band, of both bands there. And they all played together so well. Everybody was, like, well distributed. And even Miku got her moments and stuff, whether it was on her vocals or even her doing the rhythm guitar for a minute there. Um, so, I mean, for having that many members from both bands there and they did that perfect distribution, it's just, oh, shift's kiss. Wow. Not to mention just a phenomenal song in general, too. I don't know if this is going to be on the album or if this is just like a one-off like single just to kind of hold us over until the album comes, maybe. I don't know. But um, either way, love the song, of course. The Madiax, or, or I should say us Madiax, are always spoiled by these girls because they're so damn good, so talented. And I love that they've introduced me to a new band now that I've never heard it before, so I might check them out now and see what they're all about. Oh, man. But anyways, guys, as always, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead, drop a like, subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and, of course, more than anything, thank you all so much much for watching and you guys can also check out any of my bandmate reactions over here that i've done in the past if you want to watch other ones um in the meantime probably for the album and more hopefully music videos so yeah but anyways guys thanks again and i will see you guys in the next video all right guys bye <laughs>